Hello guys and welcome back to another Pokemon tutorial video. And today I'll be showing you how to EV train your Pokemon. So the first thing you want to do is um choose your Pokemon that you want to EV train. I shape Twat Docs. For me it's this Lidden right here. Next, you're going to want to defeat Max Raids. And here's where it gets interesting. It took me 44 minutes. To just... You know what, I'm just going to show you the clips that I got on my elbow. For Jigglypuff, I got a, an Armorite Ore. Two of them. And with the Blissey, I got five Armorite Ores. With a Rhydon, I got one Armorite Ore. And a lot of EXP from the Blissey. Um, once you get ten Armorite Ores, you can come over to a specific spot in your game. And this island, once you get the water bike upgrade. You need the water bike upgrade. Go over to this person. You need 10 armor right or, as I said, to do this. As you can see. The Pokemon on clear stats is lit. So, boom. Now... Now that's a clean slate. Now that the lid has a clean slate, you gotta go to a Pokemon Center somewhere. Um, I think it's the Winden one. But again, I'm not sure. I may have to come back. Will I find it? Is it Winden? No, that's that. I think it's this one and one didn't use. What is it? It's detecting there, even though I teleported to there. Weird. So it's not there. Let me try Hammer Law. Why am I going to Pokemon Center, you may ask? It's for the EV Train Guide. It's this Pokemon Center. Not more Pokemon TMs. Um, gotta go down here to the next Pokemon Center. I can check. Uh, I'm gonna go check. By the way, there's a Battle Point shop where you can get um, a bunch of these things. But I wanna buy them. I wanna buy them. Where can you buy them? I know you can buy them somewhere. Okay. I'll have to cut to the part where I find it. It's not here. Okay, I'll just cut to the part. Guys, I finally found them. Um, so, you gotta go to Winden. They'll spawn them about here. And then you just gotta go to this Pokemon Center in Winden. It didn't take me too long to find it. 
Though you need you, you do need a lot of money for this. Um I'm gonna get I need ten of each. So on best stacks. As you can see, this is a pretty expensive method. But if you're rich like me in this game, then you won't really care. It's just a nibble. Um, I will put, put out a tutorial on the best money-making methods out there. Um, a good way is to go to your, um, treasures and sell all your treasure stuff like I'm doing. Just like this. I won't, I'm getting a lot of money just like this. So if you need money, just keep on doing this with all your treasures. Just got to double check. Do I have everything? Yeah. Um. Once you have your thing, go to Pokemon. Actually, go to your bag. Well, where is this protein? Giving it all that proteins. And as you can. By the stats, uh, its attack is literally the same. What did that even work? Anyways, you're going to need a lot more. Basically, the idea is to keep on giving it these um, things, and hopefully, eventually, its stats will go up. Um, Sometimes it may take you a bit of time to find these. Come on, where is it? Carbos! That also special attack is all the way up. Um, hopefully this is a good video. Uh, this is good. Yeah, and then its stats will be really, really good. Hopefully, I just okay. What you're probably gonna do, you gotta. What I'm gonna do is HP. Goodbye. Another ten. Will well, this change its stats? I don't really know what I'm doing here that much. Um, uh, this is good. Um, I'm gonna give. Oh, it won't have any effect. Um, that's weird. Also, another guide to get. EXP, what you want to do is do a bunch of max raid battles. Once you get the auto of armor, just hunt for 
purple beams and hunt for blissy ones because those will give you a lot of exp as i showed you oh, wait apparently i failed tutorial failed tutorial oh god but if you're not a noob like me you would actually Use your armor, or do that. You, you basically get the idea. It, it's really good for battling and stuff. If, if you do it right, unlike me. I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye.